Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to make chocolate gulab jamun delight. This recipe calls for the following ingredients. Please do have a look at it. This dessert is a combination of chocolate gulab jamun and chocolate royal mousse. I'm sure you will try this recipe and let me know your valuable feedback in the comments. So let's begin. So now let's make sugar syrup. To a pan add 1.5 cups of sugar. 2 cups of water and stir it well to dissolve the sugar. So once you dissolve the sugar, add a pinch of cardamom, few strands of saffron and 1 teaspoon of rose water. Stir it continuously until the sugar syrup becomes a bit thick. So we are done with our sugar syrup, let's allow it to cool. Now let's make chocolate gulab jamuns. To a bowl add 1.5 cups of milk powder, 3 tablespoons of plain flour, 2 tablespoons of cocoa powder and half tablespoon of baking powder. With the help of a sieve, sift the flours into another bowl and mix the flours to combine. So now let's add 1 tablespoon of ghee and little water and start kneading. Make sure you make a smooth dough by adding water little by little. Knead the dough well in order to combine the ingredients and make small balls of equal size. Add 3 tablespoons of melted chocolate to a bowl and roll in the chocolate balls in it. Heat oil in the pan and fry the chocolate balls or gulab jamuns on a low flame for about 5 to 10 minutes. Make sure it does not burn. When you cook these chocolate jamuns on a low flame, it cooks well on all the sides. So once they are done, you can remove them and add it to the sugar syrup we had prepared earlier and allow it to soak for about 2 hours. Please do not refrigerate these jamuns and leave it to soak in normal temperature. Now let's prepare the chocolate mousse. Add 3 egg yolks, 1 fourth cup of sugar and 3 tablespoons of butter and beat them at high speed to form a thick mixture. So once this mixture is done, to a pan add 125 ml of whipping cream or thick cream and beat it with the help of a hand mixer on a low flame. So once you see that the cream has liquefied, you will be adding this cream to the egg yolk mixture and fold it gently. Once you're done with the folding, you will add this mixture back to the pan. On a low flame, with the help of a hand beater, you will mix this mixture until it becomes thick. To a bowl, add 3 egg whites, 1 teaspoon of vanilla extract, 2 tablespoons of sugar, 1 tablespoon of cocoa powder and beat it at high speed in order to form a frothy foam. To this add 2 tablespoons of melted chocolate and beat it at high speed with the help of an electric mixer. Once you are done with the beating, add the egg yolk mixture to this and gently fold in. Then transfer this content into the previously used pan on a low flame with the help of a hand beater. Mix the mousse until it becomes thick. So finally we are done with our chocolate mousse. We will be transferring this into a bowl and with the help of our tablespoon we are smoothening it. I am using small pieces of gulab jamuns to decorate this and placing the whole gulab jamuns one by one. I am garnishing this with slivered hazelnuts and slivered pistachios. You can use your own garnishings as per your wish. So here I present to you my creation, the chocolate gulab jamun delight. It's time to dissect the gulab jamun and it looks pretty good. So let me dip this into the chocolate mousse and give you a bite. If you enjoyed watching this recipe, please let me know your feedback in comments. Please do try it. 
Thanks for watching like share subscribe and I'll see you soon again with another recipe bye bye take care